Hey everybody, Maxwell Ventura, broker associate with Real Broker here in San Diego. This is your July quick snapshot real estate market update. So just keep in mind that this data is always a month behind, uh, going back to June. Okay, so first, new listings. New listings are down year over year from 4,300 to roughly 2,500. So that's a drop in 42% new listings. New listings are new listings is that have not been on the market for longer than a month. Now, pending sales, sellers that have accepted an offer and they are in escrow, is only down 8%. So while the new listings are way down, pendings are only slightly down. So it, it speaks to how aggressive the market still is, at least in one metric. Next is median sales price. So this has actually risen from 850,000 a year ago, this time last year, to 865,000. So we're at about a 2% increase year over year. Next is percentage of list price received. Now this is 101.3%. So that means that sellers on average are accepting offers that are 1.3% above where they initially come to market. Next is days on market. Now this, this time last year was 19 days average from going to market to when accepting an offer. And now we're at 23. So it's, it's risen a little bit. However, there was a big curve that went so from 19 days all the way up to I believe we were at 38 at one point so twice as long but now that has risen back down due to the inherent demand so we've just gone through this phase where things really started to slow down but we're back to it being super hyper competitive again next is the affordability index this is a 32 relative to a 35 this time last year so affordability is still really tough obviously with the rates being uh, where they are, I'm hearing that they're going to increase at least one more time. Inflation really is not uh, stopping whatsoever. So, you know, the feds, they're talking, they're going to keep raising rates. We'll, we'll see what happens. And then finally, we have uh, homes for sale and the month supply of inventory. So homes for sale is at 3,600 total. It was 2,500 new listings, but the total homes for sale is around 3,600. This is compared to 4,900 this time last year. So this is actually a decrease of about 26%. However, the month supply of inventory is hovering around the same. This time last year was at 1.7 months. Now we're at 1.8 months. And so just as a refresher, the month supply of inventory is just the amount of time it would take for all of our inventory to be completely dried up if no new homes were to hit the market and the market were to continue moving at the same pace. So 1.8 months of inventory, that makes it a seller's market. A seller's market typically is anything three months or less. You can make an argument four months or less, but um, definitely we're in a seller's market at 1.8 months supply of inventory. I will be back in a month from now with another market update. If you have any questions about buying or selling here in San Diego, feel free to reach out and I'd love to give you a hand. Thank you so much. I'll see you on the next video.